Man, I don't know how many times I'm going to keep on doing these Mortal Kombat videos. Update after update after update. My goodness. <laughs> I don't know how much I can take. But we got some new information on the art and the reveal of what the cast members are going to look like in the movie. So let's have a look and see what we have in stores. Well, yesterday was interesting. I don't know if you heard, but HBO Max and Warner Media, who basically is in charge of Warner Brothers, announced that they're going to release all of Warner Brothers' 2021 movie slate on HBO Max and in theaters simultaneously at the same time. And I'm freaking excited about that. And what I'm most excited about is that means Mortal Kombat was in that list, and we finally got to see the Mortal Kombat logo. Yeah. Many users were quick to give their thoughts about the Mortal Kombat logo, including one user who even went as far as giving a concept art of one of the characters. We're going to take a look at that and break it down. Before that, guys, make sure that like button, because liking these videos lets me know that you love them. Make sure you hit that notification bell, so it's videos like this one. Let's get to the news. So as I said, HBO Max and Warner Brothers did announce that their whole 2021 slate, including Mortal Kombat, would be released on HBO and in theaters simultaneously, which I think is a big win for moviegoers who are stuck at home and just don't want to get out and go to the movie theater. So we got to see Mortal Kombat on Wait, that, that list, and I love that, that they did logo. actually show us the Mortal Kombat movie I love logo. that logo. Now with that, it does kind of remind me of the traditional mortal kombat movie style mm -hmm. but it kind of has like this you know more modern metallic yep. look to it and what i think is interesting about this one is the dragon video. on the center has like no eyes i guess what you call it you know like the wide eyes so i think that's kind of cool and kind of different and kind of gives it a more edgy look but i like it overall as i said many fans were quick to you know point out that they love the logo they're excited about the movie coming yeah, me out too. including one user at missouri on twitter who went as far as showing some concept art of one of his characters, Up Zero, played by Joe Teslam. And I have to say that this concept art is pretty kick ass. Yeah. So, from the picture, you can clearly see oh, that wow. is Up Zero, played by Joe Teslam. But you also have, like, you know, it's kind of crazy. We've seen so many iterations of Up Zero over the years. Even, you know, what we saw in MK, MK3, and this is kind of what reminds me of that. You obviously have a Zub Zero that's you know more scarred in the Yo, face. The artwork more of what the, we're used to the characters from, are going to look like Annihilation, just... Mortal Kombat Three, it's but you also looking. have this more like kind of you know he's in his ninja suit, but it's it's I don't know how to describe it. It's more you know we have like the the robotic you know Lin Kuei, and I feel like sometimes in the in the mask, depending on the variation you go with, you can kind of emulate that kind of robotic like you know, vent or whatever you want to call that, you know, as far as his ninja mask going on. But clearly you can have like, you know, his, his shoulder, you know, you have like this actual ninja suit going out. It's obviously in blue. And overall, I really like this. And this actually gets me really, really pumped for the movie. Oh, yeah, they didn't so. say when the movie was actually coming out, but we can assume it's probably going to be, I would say spring or summer, mm, fall at the latest, but I would say spring and summer. What was interesting about that post was Greg Russo, who is a screenwriter for Mortal Kombat, actually retweeted it with a bunch of eyes, possibly even letting us know that Maybe that Missouri is right on the money as far as what we can expect to see from Sub Zero. I have seen a bunch of people on Twitter still talking Why about. Why am I getting Turner, excited about this already? Just the movie reacting to a and video. How that could you know outshine Liu Kang? But I think overall, if we're gonna get something like this, if Greg Russo looked at this concept art and thought, you know what, good job. I think this is you know what fans can expect. Oh yeah. I think we have nothing to worry about, guys. I think that it's always been cool to see like users like Boss Logic and other you know Demon Art, all those people out there that actually take the time to give us concepts and kind of help us kind of visualize what our favorite characters and actors would look like in our favorite character roles. So it's kind of cool to see that this guy, you know, Missouri took the time to do this and kind of give us a piece of what we can expect to see. And overall, I'm excited about it. So what do you think? What do you think about HBO Max and Warner Media releasing their whole schedule with Mortal Kombat included? Are you going to sign up for HBO Max? What do you think about this new concept art from Missouri showing us what we could possibly really see on the live screen with Joe Taslam as Sub-Zero? And we're thinking about Greg Russo giving the, you know, I like what I'm looking at kind of look. Let us know that this could possibly be what we could actually see on the big screen. I hope so. If this video, guys, if you enjoyed, hit that like button for more like this one. It's funny because I literally feel like just watching this video, and I know this is like fan art, but it could be something that looks real. And something tells me we're going to end up getting something like this in the real movie when it comes out something that i'm looking forward to seeing i can't wait to see what else i can find more updates and information on what the characters and what the cast is going to look like overall i'm still excited for this movie i'm giving this movie a chance because you know i'm a huge mortal kombat fan and i trust that they're going to do a great job with this reboot and I 
think they're gonna kill it. Yeah, I think they are.